Good morning, family. It's the Mama Home Diva. And in today's video, I'm going to take you with me to... I have to run some errands. I have to have blood work. I have to um, see if the store has any toilet paper because we got about... We got about four good rolls left. Um, yeah, so let's go see what the stores look like. I'm not gonna do too much talking before I get there because I need to charge my battery up on my phone. But let's go see what the stores look like, shall we? So this is the first time I have been really out of the house this week. And when I tell you, oh my goodness, you kind of see this, y'all. It is 7.40. So it is 7.40 on a Friday. I hope you can hear me. They have all kind of RVs, trucks, 18 wheelers. Like this is amazing, you guys. It is 7.40 on a Friday in the Walmart parking lot, I promise you, is full to capacity already. I I just didn't expect it to look like this already this morning. I mean, I know it's Friday and I know that people shop on Fridays, but it looks like a Saturday afternoon in here on Friday morning. So I don't feel optimistic about finding a roll of toilet paper. That's all I need y'all <sighs> is the essentials. So, I don't know, let's see. <sighs> the toilet paper aisle. <sighs> no toilet paper. grab those paper plates like she was mad <laughs> she was mad about it y'all because it wasn't um toilet paper all right let me do a little shopping i'll see you in a minute i just wanted to show you what i've gotten so far i'm not doing a like a whole lot but i did get some essentials some lunch meat, some drinks, some creamer, milk, eggs. I'm gonna go see what the meat looks like. Just wanna make sure we have food, you know? This is rice and pasta. Rice is gone, y'all. The rice is gone. I'm gonna get two packs of these llama beans. That's why I was getting the, um, that's why I was getting this, the, um, smoked turkey because I want to get dry beans because you can make, um, I'm going to get this jasmine rice. You can make a pot of beans and it lasts a couple days, so. That's where we at, but yeah, it's one big bag of jasmine rice down there. I'm gonna check Food Depot out now, you guys, cause, oh, I wanna check soups. Get us some soups. Let's see what's I wanted to show you what I got so far. I got a couple boxes of cereal, some soups, some all the cookware, some breakfast stuff, some bell pepper and onion. Um, one loaf of bread. I got a few meats. You saw those other I'm just waiting in line. Um, 
Not a bad line. Here, let me show you. So this is the line that I'm waiting in. Not a bad line. Behind me, other people are waiting in line also for, but I'm going through self-checkout. So, um, because I'm up next, I guess I'll see you guys at the next store. Let's hope I find toilet paper today. Okay, family, I wanted to show you, I'm headed to the next location. I'm on I-75, which is a major highway, and it is 8.35 in the morning. Y'all, look at I-75. Like, it is absolutely unbelievable. Sorry, I got to plug up. My phone's about to die, and I use it at Walmart, so I should have plugged it up when I first got here. It is unbelievable, you guys. This is I-75 in Atlanta, Georgia, 8.35 in the morning. And literally, the only reason that that truck in front of me is breaking is because cars are moving over. Like, it looks like this on both sides of the highway. And I have never been even able, you can walk I-75 south or north faster on Friday morning than driving. This is unbelievable. So I got a tip off in the store that this little outlet place that I like to shop at from time to time has toilet paper, but you can only get one box. So I'm headed up there to see if I can get some toilet paper. She also told me to try Publix as they were just opening, but I'd rather try the outlet place and then work my way back up this way. When I leave the outlet, I'm going to Sam. So hopefully between the two, I can find some toilet paper. I know that I'm the last one to the party on this toilet paper. I just, you know, I'm just really getting into the stocking up mood right now. Like trying not to hoard, trying to be considerate of others. We don't have space for a whole lot of stuff. So I don't know. We're going to do what we got to do, y'all. I still need some dry goods. Um, I got as many meats as my... I don't know how I'm going to get the meats that I have in my freezer. I really need one or two more packs of meat, but we'll see how that goes. Um, I need some dry beans um, and just a few more things for the house. But I definitely got to get toilet paper because we only got four rolls of toilet paper left so can you see the front of my car y'all know my car is burgundy that's the front of my car um so so i know why i'm feeling like this is allergies i'm not really worried about it wearing my gloves um sanitizing so i don't know i'll see you guys at the next door i'm gonna let my phone charge so it isn't completely dead when i get there all right so i decided not to take any chances i'm taking this lot and they got toilet paper. because this pollen is really getting thick out here <clears throat> and I'm getting to the point where I can hardly breathe <clears throat> and since I have a few more stores to go I wanted to be sure <clears throat> that I protect myself <clears throat> as much as possible <clears throat> I'm starting to realize that that is what causes me <clears throat> to be like that in my throat. So I stopped at Big Lots just on a whim um, to see because they open at 8 and the place that I was going opens at 9. It's actually 8.59 now. And as you can see, I got two 12 packs. They only let you get two. But I also found a cute little 
patio table and two of those posts that go down in the ground they have a light solar light on the top you'll see them when they go up um so i thought that would be cute for the outside and i had a ten dollar off 50 coupon so i went ahead um and got that and i got some febreze wet pads for my swiffer because i only have one or two left of those so i'm gonna go ahead and shoot over here to the liquidation place it's opening now it opens at nine o'clock and it's nine o'clock on the dot and get home as soon as possible. I think I'm gonna stop at this Walmart over here where I am. I went to a different Walmart, but I think I'm gonna, cause I found some dry beans at the other one. I think I'm gonna go in this Walmart over here and try to find some dry beans. There. And then that's gonna be it. Maybe one or two packs of chicken to try out my new deep fryer air fryer and that's gonna be it so let me get this Clorox in the car and I'll see you at the Whew. that was a madhouse Sam's is a madhouse everywhere it's a madhouse, y'all. And I have spent more money than I even thought. And then when I got here, they were out of toilet paper, but they say you have to be here when they open. Somebody had toilet paper when I was pulling up. Somebody was leaving, but she had been here since seven o'clock this morning in line. So I will try to get here in the morning to get toilet paper, but that's all I need let me show you what i got okay i gotta do a voiceover because it was dragging <clears throat> i got some uh members mark um washing powder they were out of gain got some crispy chicken strips i'm gonna try them in the air fryer got some assorted crackers i really really love this pack of crackers because you get a lot of different brands and it's only like seven bucks or something these smoked sausages have a kick to them they're really good they had sample um, of them when I was in Sam's the last time. And because of the sample that I tried, I really liked it. And I bought the pack. And the pack was gone in like two weeks. So I bought another one. We also have a two-pack of orange juice. This two-pack of orange juice is like five bucks. I got all of that ground beef at Walmart. So I got um, this taco kit for hard and soft tacos. I got some organic maple syrup. Sorry if you can't really see it. Uh, for some reason, this video is really lagging, it's dragging. But that's organic maple syrup, it's really good. And I have a bunch of packs of the Aunt Jemima um, pancake and waffle mix. My husband loves old fashioned Quaker oats. So I got this huge package, two five pound bags of old fashioned Quaker oats. That's what's in that container. And maybe it was like $5.99 or so. It was a bunch of stuff in there. This has really been a nightmare. Um, it's really been a nightmare. Um, trying to get groceries for my house. I really didn't get what I sent out to get. All right, we in Ingalls, 
And this is what we got in Ingle. So I'm gonna get two, four, six. I got eight rolls from Ingles. And I'll leave some for somebody else. I also found um, some packs of dry beans. I got another box of instant rice and a few cans of corn and string beans. So I'm good. I am so good.